video i'm your host no id today we are doing a reaction video to the dynasty dive uh or dynasty deep dive let me be correct and specific um so i haven't seen this yet we're just gonna watch it through i'm gonna let y'all know what i think and we'll go from there so here we go Hey everyone, Kirk Herbstreet here with EA Sports College Football 25, back for another deep dive. This time we're talking about everyone's favorite mode, Dynasty. Online Dynasty and... and honestly, this is probably what I'm going to be playing most, Dynasty and probably Superstar mode. So hopefully they got some good stuff. I've never really been big in Dynasty mode before, like as far as recruiting and stuff. I know people get really in depth with that. I've never been that kind of football player. Uh, I used to just typically, I mean, I like the draft and Madden and then like I pick them up in free agency. So I don't know how this is going to go for me, but it should be interesting. Oh, also LSU, you know, we, we here, we already here. You know what I'm saying? If you got a problem with it, you could beep that tiger beep. College football 25 can accommodate up to 32 teams, and you can play with friends for up to 30 seasons. 32 Today teams, we'll 30 seasons, that's a lot. The new 12 team Invented college football, football <laughs> playoff, recruiting, the transfer portal, and a ton of customization options to make your program unique. See, just looking at this, this is kind of overwhelming for me. Recruiting, transfer portal, all of that. Uh, Customization options might be a bit much for me. Program I know people love that. College football oh, I like has those seen jerseys. seismic changes over the past few years. And in EA Sports College Football 25, you can experience this new landscape while building your program the way you want. The it looks good, but it also looks like how I remember it looking of the new in a weird way. College football playoff. And you can play it first in the game months before the real thing. Hmm. You could be the first coach to lead your school through the new 12 team playoff and hoist mm, the college terrible, football bro. playoff trophy. Recruiting is the lifeblood of college football. And in a world of unlimited transfers, managing your dynasty roster has never I'm been I'm not going to lie. Work. I'm not looking forward to this. <laughs> Evaluate your needs and opportunities. But that's just personal opinion. Like I said, I know a lot of people love this part of the season. game. I'm not the really... The best way to build a powerhouse is to it's recruit be a learning curve the high school ranks. So let's fill up your recruiting board. Each year, over 3,500 high school recruits are generated from all over the country. I'm already with certain overwhelmed. regions representing real-world hotspots for blue-chip talent, like South Florida and Metro Atlanta. Metro! Do research to find recruits that best fit your program and determine who you can realistically land. Oh, I think song request is off. A Don't believe that. A interest in your school is decided by 14 different pitch grades, like proximity to home, Playing time oh my gosh. and brand exposure. So you'll need if to that works how it's supposed to, that's pretty cool. That'll be a good with your recruits' desires. In addition good to, way to see. for talent. Some players have a deal break. Can I just player. offer all my players pool rides? Would that be enough? Provide, the recruit will lock you out. Yeah. Deal breakers also drive a player's decision to enter the transfer portal. Monitor at-risk players and get one last chance. And I wonder how crazy the transfer portal is going to be because, you know, now they got like the, uh, what is it called? Like the players get paid now. What is that called? Why am I drawing a blank? What is it called? Um, not incentives, but NIL deals. Yeah, so like they get deals now. So I wonder like, do that play a part in it too? To convince your favorites to stay. Track your recruits as they narrow down their top schools. Pitch a prospect to gain more interest, and then set up school visits when the timing is right. It's crucial to remain in their top 10, then eight, then five, to finally be part of their top. So this, um, this is actually a brand new game, a whole new game. Um, the game has basically been on a hiatus since I think was it 2014? It's been like, it's been at least 10 years since they had an NCAA football game. So this is a brand new game. And yeah, so it's got a bunch of these different modes in it. So kind of like, you know, Apex has 
where they had arenas and then they had like team deathmatch and then they have the main game which was uh basically battle royale so that's basically what this is it has all of those different aspects on it top three as a recruit trims down but to the this top, right here i already you know it's increase your appeal if your school lot. doesn't have exactly what the process so i feel like i'm for, already gonna be at a disadvantage in the leagues that i'm in just because visits that elevated recruits i'm not gonna feel like doing like all of this a quarterback visit with i'm a very much a visit at the same time. pick up and play kind of it's crucial to player keep an eye like i'm not a casual player but i'm not like a complete sweat either you know what i'm saying like somewhere in the rough middle add portal prospects to your board just like you would with recruiting i'm gonna have to get somebody to manage my team transfers have a shorter timeline to land a new home tell them what i want and let them conference realignment yeah, yeah, is do what a hot do. topic in college football send your resume with custom conferences in ea sports college football 25 dynasty is yours to control see what a 20 team super conference might look like or revert to the traditional conference alignment shape the conference size and membership and set custom conference rules set up divisions and more that's pretty cool once you've because i was wondering how that was going to work with all of these different people in one league wanting to play with certain players or certain teams but they're not in the same division i was wondering how that was going to work that out but it seems like you just put them all in the same division or you have two divisions of like 15 or i don't know they set up the 20 so maybe two divisions of 40 I mean, two divisions of 20, and then since it's 30 people, 15 in each division, and then five computers on each division as well. Don't know. Maybe that's it's time how to it select works. your team. I'm not running the league, so I guess it's not really my problem to figure the top out. With repeat recruiting and playoff success, or build from the ground up with a smaller program and prove you have what it takes to go from an unknown yes sir we can't that's probably who i'm gonna play with i'm probably gonna play with Kennesaw. talking about your gotta play with the alma mater man start as an offensive or defensive coordinator and climb the ranks to head coach and i um take i don't think i'm gonna be sweating in this one like right i've been away. doing it matter i think i'm just gonna Choose play this to enjoy to three it three <laughs> base coaching types to start play it to enjoy it your just for the vibe will determine what coaching we'll see skill though. tree you start with I know from I'm there the so abilities we'll you acquire as you progress will determine what kind of coach you develop into unlock additional skill trees with better abilities also master motivator is crazy they could have called it something skill else trees, you can unlock hybrid trees that leverage a more diverse skill set the coaching carousel is an important part of every coach's journey whether you're the head man at your dream school or working your way up, the carousel is your way of fielding offers from other programs. Head coaches in Dynasty can actively manage their coordinator positions. So if mm. one of your staff takes a job elsewhere or you decide to cut ties for other reasons, mm. you can use the carousel to replace them. See, Remember, there's too much to have to deal with. You got people going to the league, and every people going to other teams. It's important to think about how, how I'm gonna you keep control over all staff, of this. Whether that's doubling down on your existing in real life, they got a full team that work on all this kind of stuff. Or seeking out balance for a well-rounded staff. Choose wisely. The decisions you make here will matter to your program's success and your coach's progression. The benefits of coach talents are stackable. So if your head coach and defensive coordinator have the same oh, ability, my goodness. the impact for that ability will be greater. Well, that's it for today's deep dive in the dynasty They're talking about that's it. EA Sports College Football That was a lot. 25. To make a game day every That's a lot to really digest. <laughs> that's a lot to digest. Um my overall thoughts on it is I think it's awesome that they're going in this much detail. Mind you, it's a lot of detail to me. I don't know about the people who are actually like knee deep in this mode. I don't know how happy they are, how satisfied, because I haven't seen anybody else's reactions. But for somebody like me, it seems like a lot. It seems like a lot. And I think that's good because that's what people want. They want to be able to dive in and really control every aspect of their team or their school. Um, for somebody like me who really just like to get in and play and then, I don't know, deal with that kind of stuff later as far as building a team. Like I said, in Madden, I just go through free agency most of the time. And, you know, 
draft, but the draft is like seven rounds. I don't know. It's it's just it just feels different over there. Over here, it's like you gotta recruit the youngins. You gotta keep the people on your team from leaving. You gotta try to get new people. Keep your coaches. It's a lot of moving parts in this one. So I'm kind of anxious about that. You know what I'm saying? Kind of um, hesitant, I guess. Apprehensive is the word I'm looking for. But we'll see once we get our hands on it and get into it. So I appreciate y'all for watching. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. And as always, until next time, take care of yourselves. Peace.